Hello guys, it is Ashley here, and today, if you didn't see from the title, I am going to do my favorite book. Yay! And I have like laundry on the floor because I'm, I did my laundry, but I didn't put it away. So I'm going to get some of my favorite books. Some of these books I will just mention because some of these, um... I gave to my friends, and some of them are in the garage because we just moved and uh, we didn't, like, we didn't keep everything in our room because we had to show the house for it to be sold. So, some of these books I'm not going to like show you in person or whatever. I don't know what it would be called. So the first book I have is a really good book. It is part of a series. This I actually have. I do not own. It is from the library. It is actually from my school library. <laughs> Funny story. It's from my school library and it was due March 23rd, but because of the pandemic thing, I was not in school on March 23rd. So I didn't get it to give it back. Now that I'm thinking about it, I should have gotten the other book from the series because she was like, you can get two books. So I should have just brought the other, got the other book. So it is called The Mysterious Benedict Society. It is a page turner, let me tell you. This book is really good. I really recommend it. Um, I started reading it. <laughs> in fourth grade and then I stopped reading it because it it's kind of creepy unsettling I I would say because it does talk about um kind of like mind control so yeah I would well I wouldn't recommend to anyone less than 10 because it is kind of creepy but it is a really good book um it's about these children and they are spying on this evil smart person so yeah and i will not reveal anything else because it's a really good book and it's definitely a page turner so yeah and then this book i actually have not finished but i'm just showing you this for the series like i i don't have I have the series but it's in the garage so a legion um I love if you like me you love dystopian um I don't know dystopian books dystopian movies I really like that I don't know why um and this divergent series is really good it's similar to the Hunger Games, but isn't all dystopian um, books so much as the Hunger Games. Divergent came out first, though, but I feel like it didn't, it, it's not as popular as the Hunger Games, but it is still popular. It's a really good story. Yeah, it's a good series. I would recommend. Um, so, yeah. And then next, speaking of dystopian books. I like the Hunger Games there series. I'll put like the first book right there, right there. I used to have all the books in the Hunger Games series. They're really good, Team Peta all the way. Um, but I gave them to my friend, and she because she wanted them. To, she wanted to read them, and they are in Delaware. So, um, I really love the Hunger Games series, I would reread them. I would reread this. I would probably reread Divergent, though. And that's saying a lot, because I do not really reread things or rewatch things. Um, so, yeah. And then, I have another book. I have not finished this book, but so far, it is good. It's not popular, so... It is called No Passengers Beyond This Point. It is a really good book. They um, basically get evicted and um, their mom has to stay in the town because she's a teacher, I think. 
yeah. Um, but they have to go to their uncle. And they just have a fun journey. And I haven't finished it yet, so really can't give away anything. Actually, I could, but... Um, it's a really good book. Um, yeah, that's basically it. And they're brother and sisters. There's India, Mass, and Finn. That's his name, Finn. So, next, the books. I will talk about some books that I liked when I was younger because why not, you know? So, <laughs> I have some of these books. Well, my brother does, and I brought them to my room. They're not here. Okay, so I can show you two of them. One of them is in my brother's room, and one I do not own anymore. I give them away. This, I have Last Kids on Earth book. Um, I... There's not really a plot to this, really, to be honest. Um, it's okay. No, I think it's okay. But I used to really like it, and I read it at night sometimes, um, just so I can go to sleep because I need something to focus on. Um, and Max Crumbly, I really liked this book when I was younger. I didn't read any of the other books in the series, um called The Misadventures of Max Crumbly, the first book, Locker Hero. I don't know if you can see it. Locker Hero. So I really like that book. Um, it's okay. It actually has a plot, so that's good. Um, and young kids will like it. And then another one is Diary of a Wimpy Kid. I'll put it right there. Um, I really loved that book. Um, it's okay now, but... Um, it's a good book. I like the movies. I liked the movies. Um, they when they came out with a new one, I was like excited, and then I watched it. It was okay. So, yeah. Um, I like the original movies better. They came out when I was like born, maybe, but I like watched them when I was like four or something. So yeah. Um, and then. What else? Oh, oh, I forgot what it was called. I'll put it right here. I know what it is. It's like the girl virgin version. The girl version. <laughs> I'll look it up and then I'll put it right here. But I really like liked that book. It's just like a girl version of that. I read all the books. I was a fan. Her name is Nikki or something. Nikki something. I don't remember the other one. So yeah, um, that's basically all for the books that I like slash likes. Um, oh, and also, I tried to get into the Harry Potter series, but I like the movies better. That sounds bad, but I enjoy reading books. Um, and if you guys want, I can do like a book series on my channel, but it's not going to be a book channel. Um, and that is basically it for this video. Comment down below if you want a new book series. And also comment down below what video you'd like to see next from me. Okay, bye guys. Love you. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a nice rest of your day. Have a nice tomorrow or whatever is next in your day. Or if you have, if the next day is closer. So, yeah. Bye guys.